there kids. Guess what? We are on our journey to the manger, day 11. Today, we read from Matthew 1, 18 to 25. And so it says, this is how the birth of Jesus the Messiah came about. His mother Mary and Joseph had promised to get married. But before they started to live together, it became clear that she was going to have a baby. She became pregnant by the power of the Holy Spirit. Her husband Joseph was faithful to the law, but he did not want to put her to shame in public. So he planned to divorce her quietly. But as Joseph was thinking about this, an angel of the Lord appeared. And he appeared to him in a dream. And the angel said, Joseph, son of David, don't be afraid to take Mary home as your wife. The baby inside her is from the Holy Spirit. She is going to have a son, and you must give him the name Jesus. That's because he will save his people from their sins. All this took place to bring about what the Lord said would happen. And he said through the prophet, the virgin is going to have a baby. She will give birth to a son and he will be called Emmanuel. The name Emmanuel means God with us. Joseph woke up and he did what the angel of the Lord commanded him to do and he took Mary home as his wife. You know, Joseph and Mary were almost officially husband and wife, except they had to wait a whole year before they could live in the same house. But suddenly she was pregnant. The angel revealed to Joseph that Mary's pregnancy was a miracle, that the father of her child was God himself. Everything God told his people about their savior was about to come true, that they would name him Jesus, and it would mean to rescue. He was created and born to rescue his people. This meant that he was here for anyone who belongs to Jesus. He was also to be called Emmanuel because it means God is with us. What a reason for joy and celebration. This is a perfect time to spread some joy by making your family's favorite treat. We like to make cookies and then take some of those and safely deliver them to your neighbors. I better get back to making these cookies. Hello? Hey Phil, I got you a cookie. Wow, that's my little thank you. That's wonderful, little cookie.